I want you to imagine a scenario with me. What if China conquers Japan today and held it for 400 years? During Chinese occupation, original Japanese culture gets nearly wiped out. Suddenly, after nearly half a century, the Chinese state begins to weaken and fall apart. The remaining inhabitants of the islands begin to fight for their independence. American weeaboos, longing to restore the land they've heard of through animes and mangas, volunteer to fight for the Japanese resistance. But when they arrive in Japan, they are sorely disappointed by how different they are to what they imagined. They look the same, they dress the same, and they eat the same food as the Chinese, the only difference being their language. Their expectations of eating authentic sushi are dashed by the Crypto Han inhabitants who eat lo mein and Beijing duck. The American Weeaboo Legion recites speeches from Naruto and Keon to inspire the Japanese soldiers, but they just look on blankly, unable to recognize what's being said. Nevertheless, they keep fighting until the Chinese overlords are pushed out. The American Weeaboos are pleased that Japan exists again, but have a sinking feeling that the real Japan is long gone. Now, replace China with Turkey, Japan with Greece, American Weeaboos with English classical scholars, and this shit actually happened. <laughs>